Hi Leo, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading, Leo, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading, Leo. So at the bottom of the deck, we have the world, and this is fixed sign energy, Taurus, Leo, Aquarius, Scorpio energy. So this is a card of completion. This is a card of things coming full circle, very wholesome energy. So there could be something that you're finally seeing success in. So let's see. We have the hanged man, Pisces energy, the knight of, the knight of swords, air energy, and the ten of swords, air energy. So it could be that you were stuck in a situation with someone who wasn't treating you very well or a situation that just wasn't serving you anymore. With the Ten of Swords, it's, there's an energy of actual betrayal. Like this person could have hurt you in a way and it was hard to get out of that situation. Perhaps you were too invested, too attached. Because with the Hanfman, there's a feeling of being stuck. You know, you were stuck there. But it's like with the world, you could finally be arriving at this place where you're able to release this. Like there's a feeling of successful completion and closure. Um, this person could have been someone who was aggressive towards you. They could have even tried to stop you from walking away. There's an energy of someone who, you know, who's very forceful. They want things their way and they can bulldoze sometimes. But with the, with the hanged man, you could have gotten a new perspective on the situation and kind of fleed, you know, gotten out of that situation. Um, with the, the hangman, you, like you're, you may have had some sort of epiphany or a wake-up call about this person because this looks like someone who, who may have a silver tongue. Like this is someone who likes to be in control. They are a bit forceful, aggressive, uh, even a bit of a bully. Um, and they, they liked having control. They, they wanted to keep the situation as it was, but it wasn't benefiting you the way it was benefiting them. So let's clarify these cards, Leo. So we have the Page of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. Yeah, it's like you're ready to embark on a new beginning, like you're done with this chapter, you know, and it's, there's a successful completion here. So let's see. We have the World again. We have the Queen of Pentacles and the Hanged Man again. So yeah, there's, it's like you're reflecting, you're looking at something, you are understanding something from a more spiritual perspective and with the queen of pentacles you're knowing your worth you know knowing what you bring to the table and refusing to sit with someone who isn't able to uh, reciprocate appreciate you know match your energy so it does look like you're getting closure on something you're done with something that no longer serves you that ten of swords is like you're not walking away from a situation that was good there's a feeling here of this person did something to hurt you like there was an actual backstabbing or betrayal and there's this feeling of knowing that you deserve better seeing that you deserve better okay so i'm gonna pull out an oracle card for you leo Okay, we have what do you need to release waning moon it's like you're releasing the situation it's something is it's it's done it's over okay so let's see Okay, we have give your relationship a chance work on your partnership so this person is gonna try to work on this they're gonna try to fight for you they may chase you this is someone who's gonna convince you to give them another chance they're gonna try to convince you okay so let's see okay 
Okay, we have always joyful. Write it on your heart that every day is the best day of the year. Okay, so yeah, being advised, you know, really encourage chat to follow your uh, bliss, your heart, doing what's best for you, putting yourself first and your needs and your well-being. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Leo. Okay, we have surrender to effortlessness. Stop pushing so hard. The art of living means going with the flow instead of trying to force the river. So you do need to recognize that you you don't have to try too hard. You know, it's possible that this is someone who tried to make you work really hard for them or they they took a lot and they made you give a lot and they didn't give much to you. You know, there's this feeling of you you were quite an asset to this person and this is why they're chasing after you because you you benefited them a lot. And you don't have to overextend yourself, especially to people who who, who aren't able to match your energy or people who take advantage, you know, there's a message here to surrender to effortlessness. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Leo. I hope you have a really, really good day, Leo. Bye, Leo.